find the area of the shaded region. So I'm going to go ahead and draw the picture over here so you see it. So it looks like this. This is the normal curve. Here's negative 0.98. And then here's 1.27. These numbers here are called z-scores. And then we want the area of this region that is shaded in the middle. Okay? And they tell us that the mean is 0 and the standard deviation is 1. So this area here can be expressed as a probability. Okay? This is the probability that x is between these numbers. So you would write that as follows. x, and you would put two less than or equal to signs. And then you would put the number on the left here, and you would put the number on the right here. This is the between probability. This is the between probability. So to get the answer, all you do is you compute this probability, right? This is the probability that some x picked at random is between these numbers. It's the same thing as the area that's shaded under the curve. So all we have to do is go to Stat Crunch. So I'm going to go to Question Help, Stat Crunch. Now I'm going to click this little arrow here to detach it to make it easier to see. Okay, I'm going to fix it so you can see it. Good stuff. All right, then we go to Stat, Calculators, then you go to normal. And there's a button here that says between. Okay, so you want to click on the between button. And then just enter the numbers. So the number on the left was negative 0.98. And you can see because I wrote it down over here as well. So negative 0.98. And the number on the right is 1.27. Good stuff. And then you click compute. Boom, there it is. It matches our picture. Uh, it matches the picture in the homework as well. So everything looks good. It wants four decimals, so it'll be 0.7344. That should be the answer. I'll type it in. 0.7344. And that's it.